Hi everyone, welcome back to Cosplay Genie. In this video, I'm going to show you how I made this steel battle axe from a Skyrim using a scratch stuff. Uh, this build was made primarily with the EV foam and has a PPC pipe in the center. As for the handle, um, this axe is amazingly lightweight and it's uh, detachable, so it's easy to carry in a convention and uh, any event. So without taking it longer, let's get started. With the help of the steel battle axe wedge, I drew the pattern, cutting the pattern carefully. Pin up the pattern on 6mm AVA foam. Draw the outline of the pattern. Cut out the pattern from EVA foam. Here are two parts for both sides. Now I am cutting the side edge of the sharp part. Draw on the X base part. Cut it out part carefully. Cutting the pattern for bit part. Draw pattern on eBay foam. Cut it out carefully. Parts are ready. Sending the outer edge of bit at 45 degree angle. Applying contact cement on outer sanded edges. Join them together. Sending the outer side edge of the X ahead. Applying contact cement on bit and head edges of the X. Now join bit part with the head of the X. I am cutting out the top part of the X. Cut the EV foam strip in a triangle shape on both ends. Applying contact cement. Join them together. Now sending the outer side edge of the sharp part. Applying contact cement. Join both the parts together. So applying contact cement on X and sharp edges. Join them together. Sanding edges with a stone drum head. Draw the pattern for details on 4mm EVA foam. Making the stencil for detailing with the help of a scalpel blade.
same time I am using silver acrylic color powder and filling the black portion as marked on 4mm EVA foam. Cut out the marked area. The first detail part is ready and now marking the area for applying contact cement. Applying contact cement in the marked area on both parts. Join them together. Both the sides are ready. Marking for the middle base part. Cut out for both parts. Now cutting the detailing with the help of a scalpel blade. Applying contact cement. Joining them together. Sending side edges in bevel shape on mid detailing parts. Marking the area for applying contact cement. Applying contact cement on the marked area. Joining them together. Now cutting the top part for turn into a 3D object, sanding edges from inside and applying contact cement. Sanding again for joining them together. Applying contact cement. Making stencil for the top part. Applying contact cement and joining them together. Applying contact cement and join the top part with the axe. X bottom part is ready and join it with X. I cut out two pieces of 1 inch diameter PVC pipe, one is 21 inches and the other one is 12 inches. With the help of heat gun and scale, flatten the PVC pipe. Insert into the X and check. I cut slightly on the side edges of the flat PVC pipe, applying contact cement and fixing it with the X.
marking a round circle on time and EVA foam and drawing a freehand circle around it for bottom handle part. Also draw a small circle. Cut out both circles. Sanding edges in a round shape. Applying contact cement on both circles. Joining them together. Applying contact cement on the bottom. Sticking with pipe. Cutting a 4mm EVA foam square strip for detailing and applying contact cement. Sticking with pipe. Draw the pattern in sign wave form and cut it out. Adding 6 mm EVA foam strip for detailing. Added 2 mm EVA foam strip in cross design on all of the pipe. I have already made foam clay balls and cut them off. Sticking on the handle as detailing. Joining both parts and here the base of the X is ready for priming. Heat sealing of X for closed holes and smooth surface. Applying a mixture of black acrylic color and synthetic glue as a primer and letting it dry. Here is the result after multiple coats of priming. Now I am applying the first silver chrome color on the X. Applying light brown color on the handle. Chocolate brown color on the strip part. Coloring the blank area with the black color using a thin tip brush. Applying black color dry brush technique for shading. Here is the Skyrim Steel Battle Axe is ready. Thank you guys for watching this video i hope you enjoyed this video as i love to make this prop uh, if you like this video please subscribe to our channel share with your friends press the like button and don't forget to share your valuable feedback in the comments if you have any suggestion for me any tips anything else you can share in the comments i love to hear till that bye bye